are finally on our layover after working these two flights. This is a roll up of a flight attendant. Here for early mornings. I honestly don't unpack my bag. Um, I take a shower at night, wash my face in the morning time, and I give myself eight hours of sleep so I won't be cranky in the morning. I don't have to you. Um, so yeah. <laughs> the real life of a flight attendant, let's get into it. Um, so yeah. Today was uneventful and take you guys along with me on my layovers. I'm honestly not spending money on my layovers. So I'm going to, you know, eat on, eat on the plane before I get to my layover hotel and use my Sabbath heat mini oven meal prep and try and minimize my money that I'm spending on layovers. This is another day like the flight attendant. Make sure you guys are following me on TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube. Make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. <laughs> I'm actually following with follow, or I'm actually following with the subscriber. He's super nice, y'all. <laughs> All right, y'all, good morning. Welcome back to another day in the life of a flight attendant. We are back with another early morning report. I am the galley on the Airbus 21 for this three-day rotation. Let's get into this video. So the first thing first is always put your bags away like I did right now. Whoop. Check your emergency equipment and then let's wipe down our equipment and check for our galley. Let's go. Check.
We pay for them every day and week. I do have her this one. This yeah, it's her? cool. I haven't had her place it this year, so that's a good thing. Yeah, you didn't have to. All right, y'all, so we are in Atlanta. We're waiting on our plane to get here. We're about to go to DCA. And we have like a 15 hour layover in DC. I'm about to eat by empanadas I got from Poppy's. They are so good, y'all. I just got a new bag, the Briggs and Riley bag. The lady in the crew store was saying that the Briggs and Riley better are better because they have better handles. It's always better to invest in your flight attendant equipment and have good things so that you can actually have long lasting items um i do love my travel pro it made me feel so good when i was a flight attendant i feel like all the other flight attendants walking to the airport it was just such a good moment i actually gifted it to my other friend who started flight attendant training with us um and she feels the same way so i'm so happy to like pass that along to somebody else who can actually appreciate it this is the love of a flight attendant I don't know if these are like my right color. I need a doctor so I can get. I have a subscriber and we're flying together today. Say, tell me your name. Leonard. Hey, Leonard. He's a previous flight attendant too and a subscriber. Now he's working at Delta. It's his, he's been here for six months. Don't keep, don't lose the faith, keep applying if you guys wanna become a flight attendant. Keep interviewing, keep going to interviews and keep practicing your interview skills. Start method, and that's about it. And personality, personality is key. But anyways y'all, we gotta go to work, I'm gonna put my bags up, do my job, take off. Bye. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> We also had a plane change. We are on a 320 today. We are on 320s for the entire rest of this trip. Today is day two of three. We had two legs today. Here's the schedule in this clip. He's eating. They're catering. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm good. Bye. All right. So I'm in the back. Back. most likely we're about to start boarding like this the in inbound flight was kind of delayed a little bit so it means we have to hurry up and wait for everybody else and then we have to board, hurry up and board check our equipment check the galley to make sure we have all of our required items this flight is under 600 miles so the flight attendant in the front does not get a meal service they just get regular the flight attendant does not do a meal service in the front today we haven't had any meal service on this whole trip actually all of our flights have been super short um so yeah yeah i know we on eight days they could call us and reroute us but i don't think they will you know the benefits of being a senior flight chinny all right let me set up the galley i might send up the galley for you guys it kind of gets repetitive and you guys already seen me set up the galley before so we won't do that today and then we're about to board anyway so i don't want to record while we're boarding Following the social media policy. Wait, let's go, guys. Finally, on our layover after working these two flights, this is a relative flight attendant. Child, we working. We working hard, too. 
We're working really hard. <laughs> We're working hard today. We are in DC, Washington, DC. Tomorrow is go home day. This is day two of three. You already know what time it is. I'm gonna go to the gym today for sure. Uh, I'm gonna go to the gym. I, honestly, I'm craving chicken wings. I need to fight the urge because I have food, but I'm just like, why would I not choose chicken wings? Like, I love chicken wings. Like, who don't like chicken wings? Who doesn't like chicken wings? <laughs> I like chicken wings. And I don't know, I'm just craving like hot chicken wings. But anyways, y'all, I know you're gonna ask me about this hair. This hair is so dark and lovely. Love dark something. I'm gonna put the link here for you guys. This wig is actually really, really, it's like one of my best wigs I feel like I've ever had so far this year. And this is giving, like, it's giving. Took a limb up. <laughs> okay, y'all, but seriously, enough is enough. I'm gonna get myself together. why you go to the gym as soon as you get into your layover because now I'm in the bed I'm about to go to sleep y'all this is crazy I'm so tired I'm tired I'm exhausted I'm tired hopefully I take a nap and then go work out and eat y'all food is hot and ready Ooh. this is the beef pot roast that I made I'm gonna eat and watch the breakfast club or lip service i'll see you guys maybe in the morning so i wasn't gonna go to the gym because i'm like really exhausted and then i just found out my cycle was coming on and i knew i was my cycle was coming on i was so irritated and irritable i just didn't like people I, and i was like oh i want coke and i only like coke on my cycle so i was like oh okay i see what time it is but now I edited some videos. So you guys don't know this, but I don't film in real time. I film weeks of ahead. I have so much content. So I edited like three vlogs. I'm so tired though. I'm really tired. But I do feel like going through like I feel I do feel like going to do 30 minutes of cardio just to knock it out. So I'm gonna just put my shoes on and put a head on so my wig won't fall off. <laughs> okay, cool. Um so yeah, let's go do that. Oh, look at my eyes. I'm so tired. Man, poor my, poor my. All right, we just got back from the gym. I got a coffee and a cupcake. Y'all, when I tell y'all, I knew I was like, I was a super stressed out. I was stressed out. I was so irritable today. This whole week, I was just like, ugh, like, ugh. Everything literally bothered my soul. And y'all, it's because my period is on. So I did work out. I did work out. Now I got a little cupcake because your girl... And I got some out on some chamomile tea because I knew something was wrong with me. Attitude was on a hundred million thousand leg. Like, stay Nancy attitude. But you know what? Now I know why. But anyways, y'all, we're about to lay it on down. I'm gonna make some I'm about to make some um tea, take a shower, and go to sleep. We had a 4 a.m. pickup time or four fifty pickup, so let's go to sleep, baby. All right, y'all, we are in Atlanta Airport. Let's head to our last flight of the day. We're almost done, almost done, finally. Let's go. This is why it's always important to always check your room for cleanliness and killers because you have stuff like that. 